welcome to bullets of emi so in this lecture we are going to discuss about rotation matrix let's first know about what is rotation matrix rotation matrix basically a rotation matrix can be defined as a transformation matrix that operates on a vector and produces a rotated vector so that the coordinate axis always remain fixed so you can save this or you can write this a rotation matrix can be defined as a transformation matrix that operates on a vector and produces a rotated vector such that the coordinate axis always remain fixed so basically rotation matrices are several types so in this lecture particularly we are going to discuss about principal axis rotation so its principal axis rotation here this is a point o and there are three axis this is x this is y this is z okay and this frame is let us call as 1 so in principal axis rotation the z axis remain fixed so we will provide an rotation with an angle theta with the z axis only so what will happen we can obtain the new axis here and this angle is theta we can name it as u similarly we can obtain a new axis here and this angle also theta and we can name it as b so as you can see this is the type of rotation we got here okay so this diagram represents rotation of frame one by theta so now by removing z you can just neglect it as the only uh, consider thing is uh, x and y axis so here you can see this is y axis and this is x axis x this is y so what we have got previously this is v and this is u this angle is theta this angle is also theta 
so this angle is theta means this is if we can draw this and this okay so we can find this is cos theta and this is sin theta and here this is cos theta and this is sin theta okay now this diagram represents the xy plane showing the rotation so here basically this is the thing and so you have to remember the formula as we all know fundamental rotation matrix that is 1 r2 rz theta or it can be written as rz theta or it can also be written as rz theta that means here we are considering only for z6 and with an angle of theta so we know x cap dot u cap equal to cos theta so here are the formula for z axis Theta equal to cos theta minus sin theta cos theta zero 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 and one. So this is the rotation matrix for Z axis with an angle theta. Similarly. you can find for x and y axis that is r x theta equal to 1 0 0 0 cos theta minus sin theta 0 sin theta and cos theta and r y theta equal to cos theta 0 sin theta 0 1 0 minus sin theta 0 and cos theta so these are the three rotation matrix for z x and y directions y axis respectively we can also find out the transformation matrix that is t T Z theta equal to it will be C theta means cos theta minus sin theta means I am writing this as minus S theta 0 S theta cos theta 0 0 0 and 1 so this is the rotation matrix if we add a perspective transformation matrix that is 0 0 and 0 and here a translation vector of 3 cross 1 that is 0 0 0 and this is the one this is one uh, known as basically scale factor so here it is the transformation matrix for z axis thank you